Hey guys, this is Defend Gogo, technical analyst of Allies Blue, and in this video, I'll discuss uh, about crude oil. And uh, most of the people are asking me uh, to analyze in fundamentally in crude oil. How to analyze uh, fundamentally in crude oil? Can we trade by using uh, international event or news? So can we trade it and uh, can we combine it uh, with uh, technical analysis? So fundamentally analysis uh, by seeing the news that is not called only fundamental analysis so funder if you want to uh, trade in fundamentally like uh, by analyzing by fundamentally so you have to analyze whole scenario so how to analyze fundamentally i'll i'll tell you so basically i'm doing but uh, here if i use that uh, fundamental analysis so that video will be very long too long right so let me tell you one thing how to do fundamental analysis uh, so in crude oil so uh, before i start i have to visit wall map so now you can see this is called uh, this is a wall map now let me show you this is our country most beautiful right enter that one this is called india right this is our country right and then now let me mark uh, somewhere like that here you just remember this point this point and this point and this is another point so i mark three point so you know what is that uh, first leave it this point I'll discuss later about that one so from that area one is Iran next Iraq third Venezuela you know why I uh, mentioning this name because India importing oil from this country right but from among three country one is Iran we can't import because uh, so I don't want to say what is the cost because everybody knows uh, deal with US and India so we can't import oil from here and here Venezuela right there was a big uh, story are there if I start uh, talking about that it will take two to three hour right so you just read that one fundamentally so we was importing from here, here in Iraq, right? So in that case, we know everybody suddenly uh, in Iraq uh, attacked by some terrorist in uh, uh, in oil refinery. So they reduced their production. So suddenly we have seen oil prices just spike out, right? Have you have you got it? This one, right? You remember that one? So from this area, spike down. Uh, sorry spike up up to this area again price push down so most of the people are asking when they attack there price suddenly gone up and again push down toward this and why why it's happening are there because uh, oil production are reducing right and oil crisis is going on right price might go up from this area so before you getting this answer we have to focus on today news or what going on in India and US and let me show you so right now we know our honorable prime minister are uh, where he is now he in, he is in Texas in this area in US so remember two things uh, Texas is just a state of United States like uh, Maharashtra like Gujarat like uh, like Tamil Nadu like Kerala whatever so we have like various uh, state we have like right state and uh, like that texas is a state of uh, united state right and remember this state is second richest state entire usa and the first is this one ca what is the meaning of ca the meaning of california california right so why California is most richest state of United States? Because California is a hub of 
IT, like in Bangalore, we can say uh, IT hub, right? And there is Silicon Valley, Google, Facebook, whatever IT company all are situating. And you know what is the economic? Three trillion economic, right? It is more than India. And the next research state, uh, Texas. There is more than one trillion. One trillion economic are there. Here, three trillion, right? Economic. So, we comes to know California is IT best place. So, that is why they are risk, right? So, why Texas? Second, a research state of United States. Because Texas is rich only because of oil and natural gas. Now you comes to know why I am talking this one. Because we can't import from Iran because uh, U.S. government given like U.S. given like census and they ordered us to not import oil from Iran and Venezuela. So we was importing from Iraq already. They attacked by drone. They are reducing the oil. So in India, high probability to oil price will increase. For solve this problem, Indian Prime Minister are visiting Adya. And he is meeting with various CEO like uh, uh, various oil company in which is situated in Texas, Texas best or US best company. So solve the oil problem. Got it? So what we comes to know? So that means there is a no high probability to increase again oil price. So most of the people are asking me, sir, again it will go up according to fundamentally price will go up. So when we have seen this scenario, so we are not sure that price will go up. We are not sure, right? Because our government are taking another decision instead of oil crisis in Arabian country. You got it. So here is a Texas, but question is that if you want to see here, Iran and Iraq is two neighbor us, right? From India and Texas is too far because oil will they import from ocean, right? Like that. So it will too far, far more than 20 times far from distance, uh, from distance, uh, this area to this area, right? up to this area. So if we import from there, their trans transportation cost will too high. So definitely oil price will go up. Right? But we can't expect oil price will go up because in uh, US government are giving some discount. Right? That is why we never gonna expect oil price will go up. So they are trying to keep balance in between this area because we are importing I think uh, around 4 billion uh, total uh, from world. Now in the government trying to import more than double more than 8 billion uh, like all are cal calculating in a price. Okay more than 8 billion so definitely if they're importing that much of oil so oil price will stable like that. So I'm not expecting uh, the oil price will go up. So uh, this type we are doing fundamental analysis, right? So let's uh, run to our technical chart for today and the end exit point. So now we have seen where is our because uh, by, by seeing this um, fundamental analysis, we can say the price will continuously the price will fall from this area. Every time price is running like that, we have somewhere like that, right? Now we have seen. There is a supporting area because according to our technical analysis, we have seen more tested area, more rejection are there and we drawn a support. And another we have seen yesterday, price just opened there and push down this area again, price push up this area and they form a almost it's called hammer pattern are there. And hammer pattern are forming above this supporting line, right? So, now question is that where is our entry point? For the buy entry, we must enter above this resistance line, right? 
what is the resistance line 4192 4192 that is our resistance once they break this level so we can go for buy right so just i told that price will, according to fundamentally and the price will go down right so fundamentally never tells you the entry and exit point and the fundamentally shows us the scenario in a large time frame in upcoming days what going to be happen right that is the most important most of our people are thinking hey Moody went there and uh, they have signed with them and price will fall down from this area not exactly it will uh, long term vision right not a short term so short term we are looking for enter above 4192 because that was yesterday higher point and they form a candlestick pattern right but according to me i'm not interested to sell right now so if they break this moving average or level of 4080 so i'm interested to go for sell toward this supporting line right now in between this area according to me for the long position this is called not no traded zone right we are not able to find entry and exit point properly so that is why we have seen our buy and the other above this area so we will start buying above and sell below in this area so that is our entry high probability i'm not talking like that but in between area we have seen more than 100 point are there so most of the people are thinking hey how can i lose the 100 point so let's just check it in a small time frame who people are interested trader so now we have seen in a daily uh, sorry 15 minute time frame price is running in a downturn have you seen the all moving errors are arranging and they are creating lower low and lower high and right now we have seen the price is just pushing up a little more but I'm not sure they will break this level. But we have seen this is a downturn and we have seen there is a resistance line. Right. So in a resistance line, once price comes in this area, so you can go for short and keep your asset just above this supporting line. Right. 30 or 40 point you just do money management. I already given that uh, money management calculator or you can say lot size calculator. And keep your target in PBS lower point. Have you seen this one? So that is our today trading strategy once they break this level we'll go for buy right and if you want to enter for the sell you close your position in this area so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and uh, for evening session you just subscribe my another youtube channel thanks for watching have a good day